Hello there and welcome to another GBG INU gameplay experience. I am your host Andre and it is a pleasure to be able to play this game again for you. So when we last left off, I had unlocked Metal Man by Bad. Bad, I can't remember exactly how I did it. I know which stage I beat, I can't remember the character's name, but we're gonna get started. Blast man, that's right. I'm gonna jump back at speed man stage. Hopefully I might be able to beat it with bass. Let's see. I still use the old sound and everything from the old games. You can run a level if you use a level, right? Sorry, people. I'm coming up with a bad, bad asthma attack I had like two days ago. Probably wouldn't realize I had asthma if I was talking to one of the gamers at large and doing other podcasts. So I can hurry up and move on. Jumped over all of that. I don't have to drop down there. Alright, time to take out some more gems. Things dropping bolts now. How do they shoot out of his back? <laughs> oh, I disappeared before I could grab it.
dude, I'm here. They'll probably get me this first. Yep. I got him this time, though. I'm not going to have to crash into me, because I know that's where he does the most damage. Damn it. <laughs> I say it didn't happen. How did I let that happen? Okay, maybe I'm not prepped for speed, man, yet. So, let's try quick, man. Oh, I forgot, he's not on this stage. There we go. Nice. He's a nice. Nice
one shot. <laughs> unlock other characters. I still kind of question though why those characters are working with Mega Man now. Seeing as he's beaten him and him and him and him, well I understand his reason. Now that he's like the guy that doesn't give up no matter how many times he gets beat. Keeps coming back to fight him. Even though he is so basic in this game. <laughs> Okay, so there's three levels cleared. Um, let's try Phantom Man. He's not here either? Oh, crap. Okay. I get to fight all of the ninja bots. I like the song, though. Oh. Like, nah, I'm not getting stuck there. Yep, you can cl climb some of the bamboo. Like this bamboo. Can't shoot diagonally from the ladder. Shoot at me. Uh, 
shadow. Just so people know, there's nothing there. Imagine base being able to do is just like run through a bunch of enemies, just plowing through them. That's not something I would expect to see Mega Man do all that much because I mean, because it's just not in his character to kind of do it that way. Kind of is in bases. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's not get impaled. Alright. <laughs> I bet. Oh crap a dragon. Okay. Wow, that was quick. <clears throat> that was surprisingly quick. Okay, he was in the wall. that he can shoot straight down. Oh, that's why I gotta go this way. Oh, no, I don't gotta go that way. I gotta go this way. Nope, nothing there. There was supposed to be a built building there, it's just not there. Hey, I'm taking my time drop. Oh! See, I was trying to take my time drop. Heck, he falls faster than the blast does. I get knocked back onto the platform. And another extra life. And I'm gonna keep obtaining them as long as I make it to that point. And the bolt. The 
robot armed with the troll buster. Crap, I need help, I need help. Okay, I'm good. I mean, it was seem, seem kind of anticlimactic, but I'd like to stay at least at 50%. This climbing animation? Traverse all that crap again. These damn things on my nerves like freaking Medusas in Castlevania. Anybody who's played Symphony of the Night should understand why I feel about the Medusa heads in that game and any of the other. 2D explorative Castlevania sense. Gosh, I hate these damn Medusa heads. They show up at the worst possible moment. And there's always so many of them. Damn, goodbye. You are weak as me. Goodbye. I used to love that show too when I was younger. <laughs> Just because I liked how much of freaking pain in the ass that one was. It was funny to me. Just see people get frustrated and pissed off and they like they're ready to murder or something. Time to run. Actually, my favorite enemy from the Game Boy games, Inca. And now you get to play with him. I hope that excited a lot of people because I know there are a lot of people that love that character. At least as far as Mega Man fans go. But, um, wow, I've traversed two levels without a boss so far. I want to do at least one more because I've, I've run through Phantom and Quake Man stages and Blast Man stage, which obviously no does not have a boss on it. So that will leave these three as the ones that have bosses. He looks like Airman with a freaking um, gate in his stomach rather than a big fan. But I'm ready to go and have fun and beat him. I actually love this stage. Anybody recognize this little oceanic beast? It's a different color in here and it flies in the air, but you should recognize it from a particular Mega Man X game. Any of the people who 
you know what I talk about, what I'm talking about, leave a comment. Let me know if you know. Because I dropped enough hints for you to know. <laughs> oh crap! <laughs> I jumped too high. I was trying to shoot him with the bag on <laughs> Buster. He jumped way too high. Set myself up for failure there. easily beat speed man now too. So I mean if I get through this level quick enough, I might just go back and do speed man. Actually no it no, I'll save that for the, for the next time I play. This is not like the thing has a super huge lightning bolt that hit you at such a distance. That's what I Double jump underneath spikes. Unless I have to absolutely need to. Smoke for everything coming. You need to go. Sorry, little dragon. You gotta go. Oh, this one won't die! This one won't die! Oh, hell no! Nah. Oh, no! That is precision Mega Man jumping there. <laughs> That's how you know somebody who's played the series for years as opposed to somebody who's new to it. <laughs> oh, hell no. I ain't getting caught up in that. Ah, another E tank. Hold on, why is it that only that one counted? To my bag on the tank. Oh, he finally blew up. Oh, Sorry, but I ain't jumping up here. I kill everything already? This is standing there all epically. Wow, I must kill everything already. Is that or this thing is stuck in motion? Let me see. Oh, it's still moving. <laughs> That was the halfway mark, people. Screw you. Oh, crap. You know what? I need that ball. You're gonna die. Oh, nope, I died. Shouldn't have been running my lips. Take some damage. I can probably make it back up later. Yep, she made all of it back up. Oh, oh accidentally using a tag on energy tank. Crap.
You get to fight the real anime? I have never come to this part of the stage. <laughs> so, this is a surprise for me, too. So, and, uh, wow. Oh, I didn't have the dash jump. Okay. There we go. <laughs> The bad thing is, if I tried, you probably could have made that jump from the... Oh, okay. Oh, I gotta go down. Oh, crap. Yeah. <laughs> That's not a fair fight, man. That was not a fair fight. Even though he, is, he has such low health. You have to fight the 16-bit zero. From Mega Man X2. I'm supposed to go this time. I might actually come back to Challenge Zero, but I don't want to with no lives. I'm glad you landed on top of that thing, otherwise a double jump would be nullified. Oh crap, oh crap! <laughs> I was saved. Yeah, go ahead and jump down in the pit. That'd be smart. Where is it? Oh, I can make short work you better. Wow, he hit me once and almost did me, did me in. Wow. And I unlocked Ice Man. So that's four out of the five additional characters I have put up. I'm pretty sure everybody can figure out who this one is if you are a Mega Man fan. Because it looks like they have... Well, I'm not going to spoil it. But, I'm going to go ahead and save. And I'm going to call it a day on this recording. So thank you very much for watching. Keep your eyes and ears out for more of my stuff. And until the next time, enjoy your games.